German MEP reveals brilliant reason how Britain can trade with EU from outside the bloc. The vice chairman of the European Conservatives and Reformists group in the European Parliament hit out at claims Britain should suffer for its decision to leave the EU. Mr. Henkel said it was against the interests of the European Union itself for the bloc's leaders to not offer Britain an equivalent deal. Speaking exclusively to Express.co.uk, the German also revealed how Britain could strike an equivalent deal while completely relinquishing its EU membership. Mr. Henkel said, The European Union has a lot of deals with countries outside the European Union, giving them the same deal with the countries within. Take Horizon 2020, the European research program, the Swiss have the same rights as the Germans. By the way, even the Israelis are associate members and have the same rights as the French, and Israel is not even part of Europe. The assertion that Britain shouldn't have the same deal outside the European Union, as it had compared to when it was inside the European Union, is plainly against the European Union itself. It is time the European politicians recognize they need Britain, we need the British universities for the European research program. And we need the British markets for European products for Christ's sake. This is nothing we give away, this is in the interests of the European citizens to enable Britain to have access to the common market as much as possible as it had before the decision on Brexit. EU bosses were happy enough to offer Theresa May a round of applause after she finally put a deal on the table for Phase 1 talks that the EU Council could agree to. Now Brussels is satisfied with the Prime Minister's commitment to satisfy the bloc's demands on the Irish border. EU citizens' rights in the so-called divorce bill, talks can progress on to trade. Despite EU Council President Donald Tusk seemingly offering a huge concession, by suggesting Britain could sign an agreement immediately after Brexit, bosses have now warned talks may not start until March. EU chiefs have also demanded that Britain remain signed up to EU rules for an extra two years. It came in a document setting out guidelines for the next round of negotiations published by EU Council President Donald Tusk. The document said the UK must accept a continued open door to EU migrants, meddling by the EU's Court of Justice and a ban on trade deals with other countries for a full two-year transition period after formally leaving the EU in March 2019.